of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Cougars. Welcome to SCTV News for Monday, March 11th. I'm Angelie Massey. And I'm Mitchell Schaefer. It is the end of quarter three. Cougar students are now taking their midterm exams this week, and then grading at closes this Friday. Make sure you're aware of the deadlines so you can earn the grade you're hoping for. This Friday is also minimum day. We start the normal time, but school ends at 1.50, so please plan accordingly. Also, this Friday, your Stokane administration wants to thank its senior Cougars for their performance during last year's testing season. The 12th grade AP, Dr. Cohen, has the details. Hey seniors, it's your AP Dr. Cohen here with some exciting news. Last year you did so well on your state tests, we ended up first in the district in science, second in math, and second in English, only to Helix, and that's a tremendous accomplishment moving up several places in our rankings. Um, as a result, we'd like to give you a thank you this Friday. We're going to give you a free Raising Canes or In-N-Out meal. All you got to do is come through the mini quad between 12.30 and 2.30. So if you don't have a fourth block, just come right through the mini quad, then come through the line, bring your ID so you can check in and get your free Raising Canes or in and out meal. Um, and we will celebrate right here on, the, on this front lawn, this admin lawn, and we're looking forward to it. Um, juniors, please do your best this year. If you test your best and you can do as well or better than the seniors did last year, who knows what we are gonna do for you next year. It's gonna be an awesome experience and we hope that you try your best this testing season. Thank you. It is show week for Steel Canyon players. Their spring show, Chicago the Musical, opens Thursday night at 7 p.m. in our theater. Our theater and music departments have been put working hard for months now to put in the popular Broadway show. You have just four chances to see the performances. There are shows on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday night, as well as afternoon show on Saturday as well. Tickets are just $12 online, but they'll be 15 at the door, and tickets are running low. So don't wait. Get your tickets before they're gone. A major project on campus is nearing completion. Steel Canyon faculty staff has been working tirelessly to replace the old and crumbling concrete tables and benches. But as a result, we now have plenty of nice places to sit. Bella Sedan has the details on how this happened. Whether you're waiting for your next period, eating your nutrition, or lunch, or waiting to get picked up, you've no doubt gone looking for a place to sit. But sometimes, a good place is hard to find amongst the concrete benches, and what's free might not have been in the best state, but not anymore. The, the original benches, the concrete with rebar, have been with the school for over 20 years, and there were certain areas where the rebar was starting to show through, the concrete was breaking away, and especially with the tables, they were connected by a small piece of rebar at the top, and when students sit on them, it was, it was wiggling that out, making it really unsafe. And even the school's facility staff have had trouble with the concrete benches. Uh, well, the old benches, they were like, they're extremely heavy for one, because they're concrete, and all of them were breaking, getting loose, um, more, more uh, a liability thing, Probably, we don't want it to hurt a kid, possibly, or, you know, fall on somebody, so uh, that was one of the biggest issues. But a change like this isn't cheap. They need to get rid of old benches, then install new ones, and sometimes it might be hard to justify that cost. So I think um, when you look at it as a cost per year, um, the new tables and benches is about $300,000. But if we get another 20 years out of them, then that's um, relatively inexpensive when it comes to like a cost per year. With anything that you build, you know there's going to be regular maintenance on that. Um, 23 years is certainly a long time to get out of outdoor tables and benches considering they're in the weather, they're going to get rained on, they're going to get you know subjected to sun and everything. So next time you're looking for a place to sit, look no further than our new blue benches. For SCTV News, we're Bella Solden and Nora Bushnell. Baseball is home today against East Lake at four. That's all the news we have for today. Have a great week. Raw Rockers. Cougar Pride. Get, Get some. some.